What is up all you serious people? PSP here, I'm Caitlin, and it's time to get serious. Today, I am watching the trailer for the new Spiral movie, um, the newest Saw franchise movie that's coming out. I'm going to be reacting to it. It's got Samuel L. Jackson in it and Chris Rock, so I'm pretty excited. Um, this is the teaser trailer, the first one, I believe, and um, I'm excited. I'm a huge fan of this franchise and this, um, I guess, series. Like, there's been like eight of these movies, including Jigsaw, and I enjoyed each one. The first one is always going to be the best for me, but there were a couple others that came as a close second. Um, and I just I think it's crazy that they've stuck to this one story for this many movies and it still does so well. I think it's like genius in a way. Um, and I'm excited to watch. So let's see what Spiral is all about. Here we go. What do you got there? Oh, it's just my wife, Emma. This is my son, Charlie. Do I want less? Well, less. Nothing happier than the wife of a new detective. I was cool, man. She's different. You know my wife. You give a woman 600 Tuesdays. It ain't worth three Saturday nights. How much money you got a lot? How many problems you got a lot? How many people you got a lot? All the available units, officer down. Uh-oh. Detective Banks and Rob. <laughs> executive produced it as well. Whoever did this has another motive. They're targeting cops. Oh, shoot. This shit's gonna go sideways fast. Yep. <laughs> Support group. Yes! Oh, I love it. The book of song? Oh! Right back to the first one there with that last shot. Oh, I can't wait for this movie. I am so excited. Oh, wow. So a lot of things going on in here. First of all, like, I just, I just... I think this one is gonna have a lot more humor than the other ones. I don't know if it's just because Chris Rock is in it and Samuel L. Jackson, but I, I, I don't know, like I, I just feel, and they're telling it from the cop's side more so than the like tortured person's side. Um, we're definitely gonna have like glimpses into that and obviously Chris Rock at the end is one of the victims um, or one of the survivors, who knows? I, I think he'll survive, but we'll see. This is interesting. I like this. Um, Samuel L. Jackson saying that line, oh my, you wanna play games, motherfucker? You wanna play games, motherfucker? Yes, do you wanna play game? Oh, I love it. That was like perfect for this, oh man. Okay, um, so also Chris Rock apparently like wrote this movie with a couple other writers. So that's interesting. I'm wondering if that's why there's a little more like humor sprinkled in and whatnot. Um, and it definitely, this the director of this one has directed like a few of the other ones too. Um, and this one definitely feels a little bit different. So I feel like he's trying like a different sort of like visual concept here or like a different color scheme. I'm not really quite sure yet what it is. Um, I know that the story is slightly different from their perspective, which we've seen before, but this seems like heavily focused on the cops and now all of a sudden he's going after cops and they're just seeing like the aftermath of these like crime scenes. And I don't know if we're going to see the like the original puppet that is from these movies. It looks like there's going to be a new puppet in like a top hat that was in that tunnel. Um, so that'll be interesting. And I wonder who like the bad guy is going to be this time. If it's going to be somebody we've seen before, it's going to be completely new. I don't know. I want answers. I want another trailer already. Um, yeah, it seems like this is going to be more so like in an investigating feel rather than like a torture feel. Like 
some of the other Saw movies were very much like the traps were the focus and we focus on the victims of these traps and each one is a little bit different and crazy and it's like, la, 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 are they gonna live or are they gonna die? What's gonna happen next? And this is very much like discovering and finding the clues and like the investigating the story of why these are happening perhaps or who it is or following a trail here and I'm sure it's gonna tie all into all the other movies. It did a full circle back to the very first movie so I'm wondering how they're gonna like tie that back in. Um, I'm excited. I think there was like a support group for survivors of the traps in the church scene of this teaser trailer, um, which I think is great. And um, it'll be cool to see some of the previous um, actors from the previous movies and like where they're at now and how they're handling like surviving this. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Um, let me know your thoughts, your theories, your um, feelings, um, your opinion on this teaser so far. Are you excited for this? And I can't wait to watch this in May. And please do hit that subscribe button if you have not already. We are getting really close, you guys, to our goal. And thank you guys so much for always hitting that subscribe button. To everybody who has subscribed already, you've gotten us past 6,000 subscribers. We're pushing to 7,000 now, and we're getting so close to our goal of 10,000 subscribers. We'll get the YouTube play button once we reach that. We'll get to partner with YouTube. We'll unlock features on our YouTube channel that we can use that we're not able to use right now. And we'll get to use the studio space at YouTube and their equipment for free so we can make better videos and more of them for you guys to watch, hopefully. And um, it would just be a really great, um, just a great goal to reach for the channel and its growth. And the more that you guys um, subscribe and like videos and leave comments, the easier it is for others to find our reaction videos on our channel. So it'll help us broaden our audience a little bit. Um, so please do that if you haven't already. And we really appreciate and thank you for your support. Speaking of support, um, we have patreon.com and some patrons we'd like to thank for their um, monthly donation of any amount of their choosing. And it really goes a long way for the channel. We're able to purchase like lights, um, to light our reactions and editing software. And it's really helping us um, bump up the production value of the channel. So thank you very much, Bradley, David C, David S, Esteban, Jane, Kevin, Vicky, and Warren P. Thank you guys very much for being our patrons and being part of our little serious family. We love you guys so much and really appreciate the support. Is that a heart? I don't, eh. Anyways, um, head over to patreon.com slash perfectly serious if you're interested in becoming a patron. And just for as little as $1 a month, that's it to become a patron, you guys. Um, that's the lowest amount you can give. It's just a dollar and you get um, shout outs in every single one of our reaction videos, plus an exclusive unlisted preview link to all of our reaction videos before they are posted live on YouTube for the public. So you can be the first to watch every single one of our reactions, the first to leave a comment, the first to like the videos, and the reward tiers just go up from there. Check them out all on patreon.com. I'll leave a link in the description down below. And thank you guys so much for getting serious with us. And uh, stay serious, just don't play any games. You wanna play games, motherfucker? <laughs>